Mabuhay! I'm Michelle Teresa Imperial Gumabaw representing Quezon City. Miss Quezon City, Michelle Teresa Gumabaw, an athlete, model, and motivational speaker. Michelle knows what it means to be a winner, having been victorious in volleyball tournaments and pageants before. In 2014, she started her own Michelle Gumaba Volleyball Camp to instill core values of sportsmanship to the youth. Quezon City, Michelle Teresa Gumabao. Our first award is for Miss MG Philippines. The MG award is given to the lady who crosses over and above what is expected of her and embraces an extraordinary lifestyle. The MG Philippines award goes to Miss... Miss Quezon City, Michelle Gomabao. Michelle Teresa Imperial Gomabao, Quezon City. So joining her in the top 16 from Quezon City, Michelle Gumabao. All right, here we go with Miss Quezon City, Michelle Gumabao. We need your comments on this. Throughout this journey, you have discovered that you are a phenomenal woman who is conditioned for to create a positive and lasting impact to the world around you. Time starts now. The volleyball court was the first ever stage I walked on. And uh, I know that God is using me to share my passion for the sport to the younger generation. This is how I know that I am phenomenal and conditioned for greater. Because I want to instill in the youth qualities like faith, passion, hard work, and discipline because I stand here today as proof that these can help you achieve your dreams. And I'm here to tell you to fight and never give up and be relentless in the pursuit of your dreams. Thank you. Thank you so much, Miss Quezon City, Michelle Gumabao. Representing Quezon City, Michelle Gumabao. Michelle Teresa Gumabao, Quezon City. Ningning ng yung mata, para bang mga tala sa gabi ko may kisla kisla, di mapigil ang tuinay mabighani. Our first finalist from Quezon City, Michelle Gumabao. Congratulations. Here we go. Our first question. If you are under strict quarantine and isolation, what is the most important mobile app for you and why? The most important app during this whole quarantine was my Bible. Having faith in the midst of this pandemic was very vital to me, not only for my mental health, but also for my sanity. 
It got me through the toughest of times. I was able to get through others through the toughest of times. And it kept me centered. And it kept me grounded. And that's the most important thing that I would need in a pandemic. Thank you. Thank you very much. Ari, you ready for your second question? Yes, bring it on. All right, here it comes. This pandemic has made clear our priorities, essential and non-essential. Where do pageants stand in this time of crisis? Time starts now. As we all know, pageants are a very, very inspiring event, not only to the Philippines, but to every country who supports pageantry. It is important to stage a pageant and to show the Philippines that we are much more than our setbacks and our failures, and that we are able to co overcome any adversity. Having a pageant symbolizes hope, and right now on the stage, that is who we are. Thank you. Thank you very much, Quezon City, Michelle Gumabao. Starting with Quezon City, Michelle Gumabao. Thank you, Michelle. The second runner-up is... Quezon City! 